Hi, welcome to Web Automation. My name is Victor, and today I'm going to show you how to set up your first extractor on Web Automation using the Get Started Wizard. The Get Started Wizard is the quickest way to set up an extractor in Web Automation because it takes you through the easiest path without any advanced features. So let's get started. You need to click in the Get Started Wizard button at the top right of the screen and that takes you into wizard mode. For this particular example, I want to scrape Amazon products. So I know I need the Amazon product detail scraper. But depending on your use case, you can search through our marketplace or you can use some of the filters to find exactly what you're looking for. So I'm going to activate and this will add the Amazon product detail scraper to my account. The next thing I need to do is to head over to Amazon to get a URL. I have already done a search in Amazon for iPhone 13s. So all I need to do is copy this link, go back into web automation, paste it, but also I need to tell web automation, how many rows do I want to extract? So I want to extract just 25. I put it in there, save and continue. And that's it. I just have to confirm I'm happy with the cost. Click the run now button and voila, we're off. So web automation will start extracting the data now. Once the data starts extracting, I can see some preview of the data. Then I have an option to download. I'm gonna pause for a few minutes while the data extracts. Then I'll show you what the data looks like. Now we can see it's completed. We've got 25 rows. We can check out the preview of the data, uh, see the categories, see if it looks fine, have a scroll. Um, data looks fine. So now we can download our data. We've got different options. We've got CSV, XML, Excel, JSON, and JSON line. Um, I'm gonna use Excel because I have that open. save that locally and then i can show you guys a preview of what the data looks like there we go congratulations guys uh so you have now built your first extractor and you can see what the data output looks like it looks great to me um, once you're done you can close the wizard mode and then all the extractors that you have created you can manage in your extractors tab you can reconfigure them rerun them or create new extractors thank you Gary. thank you guys very much and i'm looking forward to see what you build